is one sorry looking lucky charm. We do, it's for St. Patrick's Day every year, a pot of gold soup. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Yes. Wait, is it St. Patrick's Day? What do you think we've been doing all day? Pancakes. Oh, I pancakes. Hello, it is the morning of March 17th, which is St. Patrick's Day for us, and we are celebrating in our traditional way, which is more of the like fun, childlike, green clovers, shamrocks, like lucky, lucky charms leprechauns. That's our day when we celebrate St. Patrick's Day and we have shamrock pancakes cooking. No, they're not shamrocks. These are lucky clovers. I'm told that shamrocks have three leaves and these most, well one of them is and then it looked ugly so I started doing four leaf clovers because I want my kids to have a lucky day and it's all about green. Green, spring, all the fun things. Mm -hmm. Grab some syrup and then take your pick Ta-da! Okay, this is totally funny. I am making my pancakes with a different type of batter. It's like a paleo batter that's made with almond flour instead of regular flour. And can you tell the difference when I squeeze them out? <laughs> it's like lumpy. <laughs> it it looks totally weird. Kind of grainy. That is one sorry looking lucky charm. We've got some green buttermilk syrup. You may not have green on the outside, but they're definitely gonna have it on the inside. Spencer's got a green dinosaur on his shirt, you just can't see it. Brevin and Spencer had to scarf down theirs and so did Garrett. We had to wake up Ella early so she could join us for our traditional Breakfast. A Pringle or a sun chip. Dad is helping put together everybody's lunches. So our kitchen is a buzz this morning, isn't it? I might want a couple more of those. Okay. They were small. Yeah. Well, there is absolutely no need for green food coloring on my morning greens. Those are about as St. Patrick's Day approved as you can get. <laughs> Everybody is waiting on me. It is time for our traditional dinner. We do, it's for St. Patrick's Day every year, a pot of gold soup, which is just basically instant pot corn chowder. And I put it in a fancy pot that my mom brought back from England when we lived there. We're waiting for the pressure to release. And then as soon as we eat, Spencer's got to hurry and run to a dance concert, and Brevin's got to run to Young Men's, and everybody else is probably just starving. Jason spent the last hour mowing the lawn. I'll have to take the camera outside and show you how our yard is looking. We've got some flowers blooming. It's so exciting. They are bulbs that we planted last year. They're coming up. COVID flowers. COVID flowers, COVID bulbs. So we'll take a look at those, but anyway. Done? Uh, not quite, almost. Are those burning? Still no, burning. not yet. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> they will in a minute, then we'll get them out. I just checked them and they weren't quite brown enough. I like my rolls just a little bit more on the brown side. So there's our fruit rainbow that we always do. Where's the gold coin? All right, we barely said a prayer and Shoot. the Here. rainbow's already been destroyed. Don't put it in the bowl, okay. I accidentally put it in the bowl. <laughs> That's oh, that's where your soup goes, but you can eat it soup first. Put soup on plate. <laughs> Brother. Okay, I'm gonna bring the soup over. Doesn't this look so yummy? You guys, it's so easy. Just potatoes, corn, some onions in. A little bit of pot of gold soup for you. Yeah, because these two ate them all. It's not gonna work very well. They coming over. Yeah, bear. Okay, Spencer, let me hurry and get yours so you can start eating. We figured out something this year that made a difference for our fruit, because we go. used to buy like a big old thing of strawberries and a whole thing of blueberries and a whole thing, and by the time we added it up, our fruit rainbow was kind of an expensive piece to our meal. 
I sell these fruit bowls at Reams and we picked one up and that's what we used. We kind of split it up. I already had oranges here and some grapes. So now that I have to replenish the rainbow, I'm actually just going to do this. Oh boy. Oh boy. There you go. Enjoy. It's all mixed in together. Yay. See you later, Spence. Bye. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Yes. Wait, is it St. Patrick's Day? Yeah. What why do you we, think we've been doing why we all have day? Green pancakes and why didn't the leprechaun come? Um, it's not over yet, is it? I don't think the day's well, over Santa yet. Santa came, so. <clears throat> well, Santa's special. Santa's special. I don't know. I saw so many leprechaun traps at our school today. Maybe one of them caught him. Traps? Yes, they what do, do that. What do those look like? like? The kids bring all of these boxes with little holes and. Oh. And then they really lure kind of they with... lure him with gold oh. coins and gold nuggets. Are you ready, my son? It yes. says that oh, I if think. the garage is open, you can go out that way. Trapped, it will grant the human three wishes for its freedom. Oh, wow. Well, before it gets too dark, I'm gonna head outside to show you why I'm so excited. Look at all of our tulips that are starting to come up. There's even a splash of color. So pretty. And then we had some down here at the bottom. Aren't those so cute? And if you've been following along with us for long enough, you'll know that this also gets me super excited for springtime. It's my magnolia bush and I'm starting to see some buds form. So those will turn into some beautiful blossoms very shortly. And look, there's the bird's nest from last year. We'll see if somebody decides to occupy that this year. Such a pretty place that we live in. We love it. Leprechaun came. Who's at the door? Nobody. Nobody? Did we get doorbell ditched? Uh, yeah, we yeah. did, by the leprechaun. What? I swear it's gonna be Spencer or like Grandpa or something. Hey, nice! This is nice Dad, we need more of this. Up, Holy cow. When I woke up, I was disappointed because I didn't see any like, of this. Oh, but really? I thought St. Patrick's, Patrick's Day was like... a different date. I didn't know this was a St. Patrick's Day. I thought this was just a weird green day. Weird green day. <laughs> Look at all that cool stuff. <laughs> That's awesome. Nice. What a fun way to end St. Patrick's nice. Day. Look, Ellen. Hey, I've got these things. I'll take these in. <laughs> I'm gonna have some. <laughs> oh yeah, we could have. Do you need help getting all that in? The I know, he rang the doorbell and then like he and then I just came and then he just teleported. Yeah, he teleported. <laughs>